Hello guys, welcome back to another reaction video here on Our Eyes Your Eyes. I'm ready to watch episode 15 of Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood. But before starting this video, I just want to remind you to subscribe to the channel, click on the notification bell, and follow me in this great and incredible adventure. Guys, last episode I was speechless and I'm still speechless. Uh, hope you enjoyed. Stay tuned because now I'm ready to watch the next one. I don't know what else to say. I think it's time to watch it. Check it out. Oh, Scar, welcome back. So there is the, there is even the gold alchemist. <laughs> <laughs> I expected this from him. Well, another alchemist is over. Nature. Oh, she can use alchemy too. Ooh. Wow, how could she do it? Kai? No! Well, she knows many things. I don't think so. I don't think that he wants it. Oh, it does. Who is that man? No, Edward. Oh no, don't tell Scar about this because uh, uh... Who's there? Hey, ma! Where are the choppers then? Laboratory 5, right? We already have an example with all, <laughs> so she doesn't care, yeah. Exactly. <laughs> uh. Yes, yeah, so she is a... Uh, well. I don't think they will speak. Uh, really? Ah. No. 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 It's not him. <laughs> oh, good job, Panini. I'm so happy for her. Good. Uh, yes, but... Mm. 
Oh, Han. Where did he go? <laughs> the panda. <laughs> oh, that's China, right? I, in fact, she was a saving a scar, okay. Eh, who knows why? Stay to Alchemist. Oh, this could be useful. Oh, no! Oh. <gasps> oh no. Oh. <laughs> Maybe it's part of his family. <laughs> oh no, Panina, please. Uh, we are in a hard moment right now. Yeah. Not because he doesn't care, he doesn't have a body, so. <laughs> So the more he provokes uh, him or her. Exactly, yeah. <gasps> Ooh, oh. I told you, maybe it's part of his family. Oh no, no, he uh, I don't think he is good right now. No. Oh, it's not their fault. Uh, exactly. No way. Weary. <laughs> Oh, that's where he is a place. France. Uh. 
What? <laughs> now that's why they wanted to protect him so much or they were pissed when he was insulted. 50 clans. Wow. Mm. No. <laughs> uh, can you repair my arm? Thank you. <laughs> Wow. No. No, 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 it's better if you don't come. No. No, 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 no. No, now they are going to discover about huge death. No. Scar. Okay, this episode was quite different, but we got in touch with the new characters too, and we had the chance to meet Winery once again, that I'm quite happy because I really like her, as you all know. Now we see a different reality because we are talking about another part of this world, that is uh, the Xing country, the Xing uh, empire, and yeah, it reminded me of China, also because the name of this uh, part of the world uh, is uh, like Chinese, so that's why I said, uh, ah, is it China? <laughs> yeah, we see that this Philosopher's Stone is, is known everywhere, and many different people have many different reasons to get in touch with that, but for sure, I think the purpose uh, to become immortal and what this new character, this new prince wants to do, it's something that is not going to happen. I mean, I don't think Edward will help him or he will give this Philosopher's Stone to him once he will be able to get in touch with it because he has his own purpose and I think uh, Edward uh, is uh, waiting for this moment for such a long time that he is not going to share it with anybody else once he will be able to reach it. But absolutely, we see a different way to use alchemy too because this prince is telling him that in their side of the world, in their country, in their part of the world, they are using alchemy for a different reason. They are using it as if it's a medical tool. On the other side, Edward is correct because in their side of the world, they are using alchemy for war purposes or because of uh, battles and stuff like that. So definitely here we see two different meanings of alchemy and how alchemy can be used and here we understand also that we can use alchemy for good purposes instead of a bad purposes it depends how you use it and this is really good because we understand how many people rely on alchemy so many times and in so many different contexts edward is depending on alchemy and we see this throughout his entire life since the beginning, since he wanted to revive his mother. And every time is an excuse to use it, no matter what, when he feels that he's in danger, when he feels that he needs support or he needs help, he is using alchemy. When he has to fight against another person, he is using alchemy. So he is not using alchemy as something for good, especially because when he wanted to revive his mother, then uh, a mess started uh, from that moment. That's why maybe it's something good for him to use alchemy in a different way. That's why he wants to receive new info about how to use alchemy in a different way. 
and I think this is really awesome. I think uh, now with all these characters involved, uh, uh, the story will change a little bit. Also because we saw, also because we saw Mei Chen using alchemy in order to heal the scars, uh, injuries. So. Uh, definitely, I don't know if there is a connection between the Mei Chang and uh, this uh, prince. We will discover it later for sure. But absolutely, I think even Scar, he was reluctant a little bit. He didn't want to get in touch with this baby girl. Once uh, he saw that she was taking care of him, he decided not to reject her. Probably he wants to get in touch with her because he can reach a certain place. Also because she wants to meet Edward and definitely he wants to defeat Edward, on the contrary. Let's use this Mei Chang in order to reach Edward and in order to kill Edward because of his purpose. The Mei Chang wants to meet Edward because she thinks that he is <laughs> like a prince. <laughs> she has uh, an idea of Edward that is not corresponding. I mean, he is cool. Edward is cool, but he is not what she is imagining. On the other side, now oh, something bad is happening in the next episode because Winry wants to go back to meet Hughes and to say thanks to him. Look, uh, something bad is, uh, is about to happen because even Edward doesn't know that Hughes died. So I don't know what their reaction will be. I wanted to remark another thing before ending this video. I think all is becoming stronger. I told you already in previous episodes, and even in this episode, I saw how Al is improving his skills more and more, little by little, and even Edward is realizing this. Usually Edward felt to be the best of the brothers, the person who was the older brother, but at the same time, he feels to be more powerful than all, and he wants to protect all. But at the same time, as I told you in other episodes, in previous episodes, I think these two brothers, they can exchange when they need. I mean, all can become stronger and protect Edward, and on the contrary, Edward can become stronger and protect all when they need. For sure, Edward needs to understand that no matter if he is the older brother, and no matter how much he wants to protect him, at the end of the day, all oh, most of the times is protecting Edward on the contrary so <laughs> that's something great to see because usually we think oh the older brother is uh, the brother that has to protect the others that are younger etc 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 but that's not true many times it can be the opposite and this is the perfect case okay guys I think for this episode that is it hope you enjoyed I think uh, look the next episode will be really really sad I'm preparing myself. Anyway, see you on Wednesday with episode 16 of the Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood. In the meantime, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and click on the notification bell. Bye, see you in the next video. Bye.